Right, let's look at how you can use predicting to help you in the test. Before each listening section, the speaker on the audio file will always give you a short introduction to the next section. For example, You're going to listen to a telephone conversation about libraries. And tell you that you have some time to read the next group of questions on the question paper. For example, First, you have some time to look at questions 1 to 5. After this, there is a pause for about 30 seconds when you will hear nothing. But what do you think you should do during this pause? Well, we tell our students that this is a golden opportunity to prepare yourself for listening by thinking about the situation and the vocabulary in the following listening section. In fact, you should ask yourself questions like these during the pause. Who will be speaking? Where are the speakers? Why are they talking? What are they talking about? You should use all the information that you have for this. The introduction you have heard, the instructions on the question paper, and the questions on the question paper. When you predict like this, your mind should also be able to identify the topic of the listening and the words which are most likely to be heard in the listening. If you can use your time to predict, as I've described, you'll give yourself an advantage when you have to answer the questions.